How to program a door monitor. To enter into programming mode, unclip the top cover from the door monitor, remove the battery for a few seconds, hold down the enter button and then refit the battery. Then you'll need to release the enter button and the LED in the front of the door monitor will flash green to indicate the current preamble ID. Note, if the preamble ID is zero, the LED will flash green, amber, red. To program the preamble ID, enter the required preamble ID by pressing the units button. For example, for preamble ID 3, you would press the units button three times. The preamble ID can be zero to seven. This must match the RFE DIL switches 6 to 8. Then press the enter button to confirm. The LED will then start flashing amber, green to indicate the current PAN ID. Program PAN ID. Enter the required PAN ID using the tens and units buttons. For example, the PAN ID 23, you would press the tens button two times and the units button three times. The PAN ID can be 0 to 31. This must match the RFE DIL switches 1 to 5. Press the ENTER button to confirm. The LED will start flashing red, amber, green to indicate the current house code. Then to program the house code, enter the required house code using the hundreds, tens and units. For example, the house code 123, you would press the hundreds button once, the tens button twice, and the units buttons three times. The house code can be 1 to 999. Then you'll need to press the enter button to confirm the LED will start flashing red, amber, green to indicate the current unit ID. To program the unit ID, enter the required unit ID by using hundreds, tens and units buttons. For example, the unit ID 456 you would press the hundreds button four times, the tens button five times, and the units button six times. The unit ID can be one to nine nine nine. Then you'll need to press the enter button to confirm. The LED will start flashing red, amber, green, to indicate the current override timer. To program the override reminder time, enter the required override reminder time using the hundreds, tens and units buttons. For example, for 45 minutes, you would press the tens button four times and the units button five times. The, over the override time can be zero, disabled, to 240 minutes. Press the enter button to confirm. The LED will start flashing green to indicate the current alarm level. Program alarm level. Enter the required alarm level using units button. If, for example, the level three, press the units button three times. Level one, call priority door open alarm, orange banner on screen. Level two, Assistance Priority Door Open Alarm Yellow Banner on Screen Level 3 Emergency Priority Door Alarm Red Banner on Screen Then press the Enter button to confirm The LED will start flashing green to indicate the current number of hops Default 8 hops equals 8 flashes Then you'll need to program the number of hops Increment the number of hops using the Units button Press once for 9 hops twice for 10, three times for 11, or four times for 12 hops. Any further button presses are ignored. If the units button is not pressed, the previous setting or default is retained. Then press the enter button to confirm and then the programming is complete.